previously on Andy Mack. So, you and Jonah, we were spending all this time together, and I guess we realized that we might like each other. I forgot how much work it is being with Amber. Amber's not asking that much of you. Just regular boyfriend stuff. You just have to decide what you want. So you're back in touch with Marty, huh? I missed him. We used to spend a lot of time together, and it was fun. I should probably tell you that I have a girlfriend. You still run? Yeah, you bet. Mostly long distance now. Are these your wedding invitations? I can explain. So, you two are not getting married? I don't want to risk this for a party. I always knew that this was never going to happen. If you see Cece, don't worry. I'm not breaking Cece's heart. You got to do that. You're not joking. joking? Your parents really aren't getting married? Oh no, Bex and Bowie broke up? No, they're still together. They're just not getting married. It's the opposite of my house. My parents are still married, but they're barely together. Anywho. I'm sorry. You must be heartbroken. No, I'm really not. But you've been wanting this for so long. Don't remind me. And you were so close, just weeks away. I just said, don't remind me. Ooh, touched a nerve. That's what it is. You're not heartbroken. You're furious. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. And the worst part of all of it is I can't tell them because they already said you are totally entitled to your feelings. Which I guess is a really nice thing to say. And really manipulative. What do you mean? Well, it's like, it's like you're playing emotional dodgeball. And you're on one side and Bex and Bowie are on the other. And you have this big ball of rage that you want to hit them with, but they're ready for it. So if you throw it at them, they'll catch it. And then I'm out. How about that metaphor, people? I just came up with that. But what am I supposed to do with this ball of rage I'm holding? I don't have anywhere to put it. I do. This is a rage cage. So, what do we just repeat after me? 